Meanwhile, a second family claiming to be friends with the entertainer was introduced to CNN late Thursday by an associate of Jackson's. Then Anthony Pelicano brings these two little boys forward to talk to a CNN reporter. As with 11-year-old Brett Barnes interviewed Wednesday by CNN, Joy Robson and her two children say they frequently stayed at Jackson's Santa Barbara County Ranch and that 10-year-old Wade had slumber parties with Jackson, sleeping with him in the same bed. Yeah, you know, there's been different times where it's just be me and Michael. And they told the reporter that they slept in bed with Michael Jackson all the time. And like two little parrots said the same thing, but nothing ever happens. He sleeps on one side, I sleep on the other. It's a big bed and we just go to sleep. It came off as if these two children had been coached on what to say. When you'd have sleepovers and you'd stay in the same room or the same bed, did that seem unusual to you at all? No, because I slept on one side of the bed, he slept on the other. Sleep in the same bed, we're both fully dressed, pajamas. It's a huge bed, he sleeps on one side, I sleep on the other. Because I slept on one side of the bed, he slept on the other. He sleeps on one side, I sleep on the other. He slept on one side of the bed, he slept on the other. I look back at that video of those two young boys and I, I sort of cringe knowing what I know today. Wade Robson looks so innocent and sweet, but now we know he stands with Jackson's accusers. From your standpoint, does it seem unusual for a 34 year old man to have kids sleeping over? Not when you know Michael's background. Everybody knows he didn't have a childhood. And in a recent court case, Wade's mother, Joy, testified under oath about that CNN interview. You gave interviews on TV defending Michael Ray. Well, we were sort of coerced to do that by Anthony Pelicano. Huh. Really coerced. Did you at the time feel coerced? Yes. Yes, um, it's not easy to go on television and admit that you've allowed your son to sleep in somebody's bed, even though at the time, I thought, I knew, how, I knew how it appeared. Although I didn't think there was anything going on, I knew how it appeared. Anthony Pelicano was an interesting man. He spent a lot of time with us. It's fair to wonder how lives could have turned out differently if Anthony Pelicano hadn't been working for Michael Jackson in 1993.